Everybody, welcome back to Green Country Baits. Today we're going to do a zombie crawl pattern known as the zombie stalker. Paint session coming up right now. Alright, zombie stalker. So we're going to do a purple undertone. It's real light. So we can get a little glow through effect. Then just a white base over the top. And the reason we're doing this, we want to keep that belly transparent, clear. We're going to get the purple showing through. A little more white. Come over the top with a canary yellow. Quite a few colors goes into this particular pattern, and as usual, I'll show you at the end which ones I've used. Make it your own, you know. Um, golly, you got a thumbprint, which it'll get covered up with. Now we've got a mixture of brown and orange here. Just gonna do a little out outline. And we'll start adding some. God, what is the deal with my paint right there?
Pain. Zombie stalker. Which one is that? That purple one. Talk. Oh, this one? Mm hmm. What's this one? Uh, that's, uh. I don't remember. <laughs> how, far you, how many more bases you got paint? Three more patterns, but I ain't doing them all tonight. Just adding some detail there. Now we'll come back and I got to clean out four airbrushes and we got two or three more, two, three more colors to go. So just kind of an old rainy day here. Looking forward to what this year brings. Let me know in the comments what you think of of this pattern so cleaning out some airbrushes here i'm gonna leave that orange in just because in case i need to touch up so for our top color we're going to go with this lime green just kind of throw down a little base and we'll do some texture above it that's what the deal was had pressure too high so get into detail work you sure want to I'll throw down a little lime green on these shoulders. And we're going to come back with some blue green. Add a little detail work. Real fine detail work, so just a lot of squiggly lines, real fine. Ah, man, I'm going to have to do a little heat set. Something up on the air temperature today. Left some blotches because we're going to put some black dots inside there. We're going to add a little bit of texture to this thing. I've done that in my five millimeter brush. Should have done it in my three. All right. Again, we're just making some irregular patterns. Because it's decaying. That's why we got the irregular. It's a zombie. All right, do a quick color change here. We need to get on to our uh, black. And now we're going to put our crawl lines in and, and some other details. Or 
first thing, we want those eyes, eyes darkened in. some black dots just real small so we're going to add a few other textures my FX texture and we're going to add a little bit of this down in here. Just to give it a little bit of texture down here on the bottom. Come back with my brown, orange brown, whatever you want to call it. Crank the pressure back up. It's pretty subtle, subtle. Let's see, I'm going to take this off. I had a little flap not want to stick, so. Now you want to slowly remove that. And these I pre-cut. I think I've done a video on it. 
If I haven't, you'd like to see how I cut these out of frisket paper or whatever, then leave a comment. Clean up these lines a little bit. Just gonna freehand the thing because Pulled a little bit of the black edges up, so what I'm doing is just touching that back up with a little little freehand. Camera may not be picking it up, but. Now, I don't know if the camera's showing that, but see how that purple undertone picks up in there? So all I'm gonna do is dust the nose of the throat of this bait with a little of the purple. rest is going to shine through so it's going to be a clear body bait for the exception of that throat area anyway guys let me know what you think of this zombie stalker uh, transparent belly a little purple glow undertone, no paint. Uh, purple throat, colors that went into this. A uh, pearl purple undertone, uh, followed by white over all the base. Then came back as a secondary base over the white with a canary yellow. <clears throat> then I mixed four parts of transparent orange to two parts of brown, a light brown. And that's my highlight colors. Then lime, pearl lime green on the shoulders. Over the top of that with some detail work with some detail blue green. And finally black. So we'll put some eyes in this. Guys, that's the zombie stalker. Give me a thumbs up. We'll see you next week.